right guys, today it's me Olivia and we're going to be doing another live unboxing secret word of day. Ah! And my brother is here and my dad as a special guest. Come on over. Um, Olivia, did you, did you say it's secret word edition? Yeah. Yeah, this is long overdue guys, so. And we got three boxes, not one, not two, again, three. Three boxes, you know but, why? I'm not having a seizure. <laughs> I'm just joking. He's just tired. <laughs> he looks like he's freaking having a seizure. <laughs> what is he dying? My tongue is purple. Oh, here are four guys. Uh, leave uh, leave uh, that on the comment. A comment? Hello. Uh, so, yeah, because I'd rather look. So, wait, 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 wait. If you like Thor. So, you're asking everybody if they prefer Loki or Thor? Yeah, and you want them to comment? All right, yes. we will see, we will see, we will see. Who do you think, who do you think is going to be the winner? Uh, Loki or Thor? Oh, uh, Loki. You think, you think people like Loki more than they like Thor? Loki's much more cool. Loki is cooler? Yes, he's funny. All right, all right. At least. Here we go, watch out, watch out. Oh my God, it's customs inspected. Oli, they opened Can my box. It? Can I rip it? Maybe they thought there was drugs in here. Can I rip it? Can I rip it? Meanwhile, it's just comics. Yes, yes, hang on. Let me let me cut it open. Ooh, customs inspected. Why does that sound so good as an ASMR? Oh my freaking mother. Oh, hallelujah. Oh, hallelujah. From the other side, bro. <laughs> I could do that better than him. Wait, because I need to get the right Oh, wow. Use those Hulk muscles. Oh, I'm yeah. doing the they next one. They take this. They take <laughs> All right, here we They're go. They're supposed to keep it. Dude, you, you ripped the box, man. I got to reuse these. Easy with the Hulk muscles. Oh, I'm not Hulk, I'm you Venom. You're Venom. Okay, okay. Here we go. I wish you guys could hear this. So then we're do it guys, um, I'm not going to give the grades because the whole box is Baba, mine. Say not yet. Relax. When are you gonna? Uh, the whole box is nine point eight. So. And guys, one you guys should have secret word. And all the other ones, comment them inside the website. And then you will become a millionaire. I'm just not a millionaire. Say. Relax. So we're giving away a hundred dollar book. Uh, so we have something is killing Why the children. Always squish me. In your this video. is uh, this is uh, what's it called? The foil variant. Nice one. That's for Ian. Hey, you touch my candy. Ew. <laughs> yeah. Something is killing the children. Another foil, the pen and ink, foil edition. Very nice. That was from Fan Expo. Is that uh, a freaking zombie? Also for Ian. Like no, that's zombie. Erica Slaughter. Oh, Ultimate Invasion. Beautiful. Uh, Christopher, uh, jo John Taylor Christopher cover. That's oh, the... Chris, that's you. No. <laughs> no, no, no. I that's, make that's super cool. Uh, that's uh, that's for Ancho. Yeah, guys, I want to make something as. I'm just joking. That's a cool cover. What you this no, is nice. No, no, no. Oh my god, look at this. I'm I was foil. just joking. No. I was just joking. It's beautiful. Whoever this one is for Ian. It's that beautiful. Was <laughs> that was Ian's, actually. I'm a big fan of her. Big fan. Oh, Detective Comics 880 Foil Edition. This is a beautiful cover. Uh, cover by Jock. Look, uh, uh, look, look at that one. Yeah. What are you talking? Oh, like Catwoman that. 14. Another. Is this a foil? Oh yeah. My God, uh, gold foil cover. Very nice. That's a beauty, man. That's a, oh. Wow. DC Boutique variant. Is it made out of gold? Gold foil. It's gold? Ultimate invasion, baby. So it's gold. Another foil. Uh, it's gold foil. It doesn't say mean? real gold foil. Just gold foil. Curse this world. <laughs> Next, we got Ghost Rider and Wolverine. Well, there is, a foil. is this the first cover appearance of Helverine? I don't think so. Who's Helverine? There's it. Wolverine becomes Ghost Rider, so he becomes Helverine. Also, one of my favorite. Stop. Oh, there's Here, another one of my favorite covers. Uh, nice. Yeah. Um, what to go? Uh, also, so, so 
the new dead the new Deadpool. Can you go has, see the cats over there? They're fighting, I think. Has uh, Olivia? Go check, Olivia. Go quick. No, I. Uh, uh, well, Sorry about that's that. going. Um, what do you go? I'm gonna be talking about Deadpool, the new Deadpool, about the TVA, and they're gonna uh, remake it. And it's like Deadpool. Oh, it's but like no, there, 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 there's no um. Wait. There, wait. wait. There's uh, uh, B B15 and the uh, C21 and blah, 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 blah. Uh, they're not there. It's all new people. Um, what do you call? Not, 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 not even who's the guy? Um, Loki's not there. Well, we don't know. We saw a 30-second teaser. It wasn't even a full trailer, Chris. Uh, we will see when the trailer comes out. Also, what? there's powder on the floor. Well, it's probably from her candy. Oh, dang it. Yeah. Gotta wash the floor. <sighs> All right, Looney Tunes, 274. That's one for uh, James. Actually, Austin. guys, I'm going to leave you guys alone, nice. so bye-bye. You're done? Yeah, I'm done. That's all the help I'm getting? Wow. There's too much sand. Olivia, go upstairs and put the candy away, please. I have to clean the floor now. Please go upstairs and put the candy away. Upstairs. Upstairs. Upstairs, man. Fucking candies and stuff. I swear. Can't do anything with kids these days. Always doing some kind of stupidity, man. Uh, I told her, candy and comics don't mix. Keep your candy upstairs. But no. It's like talking to walls. All right, so next we have Harley Quinn Joker uncovered. Very nice. Throw those there. We have Batman 134, Art Germ Foil. Uh, that's the one in 50. Very nice. Oh, Guma number one. The foil. Can't see this one too well. The foil variant. Need some better lights here. Nick, man, you got to come install me some better lights. Can't wait till Saturday. That's gonna be good. All right, put that one away. Next, oh, beautiful Wolverine foil. That's nice. I forgot I had sent that one in. What else do we have? Oh yeah, Spider-Gwen Smash. Another foil. It's Foil Mania. Now I know why they all got 9.8s. Zatanna. That was the uh, New York Comic Con exclusive, I think. Cool, another foil. What else do we have here? Oh yeah, variant edition for Marvel Meow. That was the tribute to uh, Lion King. Lion King, right? Right, and then we have the other variant cover by uh, Zulo. Very cool. Very nice. I love her style. Um, seen quite a few of her covers. She did some nice trick-or-treat covers for Halloween for DC. I have a few of those as well. Um, that's the 1 in 100 from Art Germ for She-Hulk number 1. I think it was a 1 in 100. Could be a 1 in 200, but pretty sure it was a 1 in 100. Ah, here's speaking of the trick-or-treat uh, covers, uh, Halloween. Pretty cool. That's for Wonder Woman number two. Love that. Then we have uh, Teen Titans number four. Again, the Halloween trick or treat cover. Oh, here's a nice one, man. This is the first appearance of Kid Venom. And also a one in 50 for Delato. That's Death of Venom verse number two. Very nice. Very nice that oh this is amazing we have one of my good buddies Danny Lowe sold me this a while back so happy that it came back in 9.8 this is crazy 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 book to get a 9.8 on man really tough and then we have the new hot book of the let's say month I don't know man this is pretty cool. These things have been uh, 
really popping because people are uh, saying that, you know, that's the first new Peter Parker. It's the first uh, new uh, Ultimate Spider-Man uh, first appearance. So this predates, that predates, uh, what's it called? Uh, Ultimate Spider-Man number one that just came out last month. So uh, really cool that I got two nine eights on that. Very happy with those results, can't complain. A whole box of 9.8s doesn't happen too often. Let's see what the other box is. Maybe another box of 9.8s here. We shall soon find out. We shall soon find out. All right. Oh, oh boy. Yeah, not bad. Not bad at all. Not all 9.8s, but close enough. Close enough. Oh, I love the first one. Very nice. Spider Boy. Andrew's uh, variant. That was an exclusive for Unknown Comics and Comic Traders. Wow. Love it. Love it. I can't remember who sold me that. I can't remember who sold me that. I think it was Dan. Daniel. Another Dan. Uh, thank you for this one, uh, 9.8. That one was, uh, was Mark Pache. Thanks for that one. We have another Andrews foil cover here. This one's a beauty, 9.8. That one's been pretty, uh, selling pretty well still, uh, going for about $100 online the Andrews uh, foil for Spider-Boy. I was quite surprised when I saw that. Here we have She-Hulk, unfortunately foil that hit a 9.6. Again, I think I see a little, like a minor, minor chip on the foil on the back cover. And that's about the only defect on this book. Wow, wow. I, I would have I thought that was a printing defect and the book would have still got a 9.8, but obviously not. I mean, the Spider Boy actually has a crease at the top and bottom, and it's still got a 9.8. Mind you, it doesn't break color, but still, still, I was worried about the Spider Boy. Next thing you know, the She Hulk gets the 9.6. Oh, Batman Adventures 12. Such a beautiful cover. That was the Comic Mint Special cover A by Will Jack. And here I believe we have cover B also by Will Jack. Very nice. Love that. Hopefully I will be able to pick up a set myself one day. We will see. This is another beauty, Titans. I have one of these. But this one is for Sir Nick. Very nice. And then we have an Andrews Spider Boy for Nick as well. Next we have, oh, that's one of mine, Batman. This one I also got from Mark Pace. Thank you, man. For that one. Then we have a Daredevil. Wow, I was expecting at least a 9.6 on this. Gotta say a little disappointed. Nine fours aren't really worth much, but can't. Sorry, excuse me. Uh, can't win them all. This one I'm very happy about. I got this from uh, Henrik. Thank you, man, for the nine eight on that. Then we have this Hulk. Can't remember where I picked this up, but oh, happy it's a nine eight. Not too fond of the cover, so probably sell that one. This, guys, this was a 9.4. I cracked it open, and I could not believe I found breadcrumbs inside the book. I was like, how is this even possible? Why would they even leave them there? Why would the person grading the book not take the breadcrumbs out, at least? Well, lo and behold, it's a 9.8 now, so minus the breadcrumbs, I guess. Then we have this beauty. This one is for Martin. 
Martin Mann, congrats on the 9-8 for Star Wars. Republic number 52. Oh, wow. And a 9-8 on Star Wars 41. Bro, that is nice. Nice from 1980. You don't see those too often. And we also have a Daredevil 131. Very nice, 9.0, man. That is pretty solid. For a book from 1976, first appearance of Bullseye. Sweet. Very sweet. Then we have Daredevil 257. That is versus Punisher. Nice, 9.4. Oh, so, sorry, guys. Just a little struggling with a little bit of pain. Uh, we have a Moon Knight 25, uh, 9.6. That's an all-black cover. Three copies I've submitted of this book. Still haven't gotten a 9.8. Still haven't gotten a 9.8. Same for this, man. Three copies and maybe four copies. Best I got was a 9.6. Man, this thing... One spine tick. Hardly breaks color, man. One spine tick and one staple. One tick at the staple. Shit. Uh, still harsh. Quite harsh, man. This should have been at least a 9.6. At least a 9.6. Here, however, this one. This one. Uh, what's his name? Keith is going to be very happy. Because his new stand is a 9.8, man. Very nice. Congrats, Keith, on that one. Um, here we have a Venom. This is a very regular Venom. Lethal Protector, nothing too crazy. Usually pretty easy book to get a 9.8 on because it's a cardstock, good quality paper on the inside. So it's uh, not too surprised that one came back 9.8. I didn't even have to press it. This one also was pretty good, solid, cardstock. I thought it was gonna be a 982, man. But this one only got a 96. A little disappointed, a little disappointed, I have to say, man, because there's a huge, huge price gap between a 96 and a 98 on this book. And uh, Honestly, there's some very, very, very minor, minor color rub in the back. But that's it, man. This book, it hurts. A 9.6 on this one hurts, man. I gotta say. But I'm happy for a 9.8 on that. First Gunslinger Spawn. Very, very, very nice. And that's for the same guy that owns this second appearance of Gunslinger. So I'm sure they're going to be happy that was their first submission with Comic Book Corner. And, you know, not bad to get two nine eights of a very high value book. And last but not least, we have this book, which has a very, very interesting history. This book here was originally uh, raw. We sent it in. First time around, it came back at 9.0. And I was stupefied. Because in my opinion, this book should have been at least a 9.4. Minimum. And it was better than the 9.4 we got back already. So how could the 9.0 look wor better than the 9.4? So I kind of told the, the owner of the book that he should definitely resubmit. And thank you. God, he listened because now it's a 9.6, man. Holy crap. 9.0 to 9.6? That's a pretty critical error on CGC's part because it's the exact same book, man. Exact same book. I didn't do anything more to it or anything less. Maybe gave it another press and that's it. So, can't really say that human error never occurs at CGC. So when you get a book that you know for sure the grade doesn't seem right, man, something is off, you have to resubmit. Don't leave money on the table. Don't settle for that lower grade. 
it's human error. There's just average people like you and me that are grading these books. And sometimes people make mistakes. So let's get to the last box, guys. I know you've been waiting a long time. And uh, this one's been sitting upstairs for a while, but I wasn't well enough to do the unboxing. And today I'm, thank God, feeling better. And hopefully, uh, hopefully uh, we'll have some more unboxings shortly. I'm expecting some more books back next week. Um, I do want to give you guys the secret word because you've been super patient. I have no idea if it's going to work. I don't know if uh, that, look, we, we created a Facebook page. Uh, I haven't seen anybody post on it yet. So I don't know if uh, it's going to actually work. Like I said, it's it's something that we're trying. It's something new. And uh, hopefully you guys can post on there. Like I, I'm, I'm hoping that it works. But if you guys want to know the last word, the last secret word is family. All right, guys. So uh, head on over to our Facebook page, Comic Book Corner, and uh, write down the three secret words. And you guys, first person to write it in, again, will win that Spider-Boy first appearance, uh, which is right here. This is, this is the book we'll be giving away. And uh, hopefully, like I said, in theory, I hope it works and you guys are able to uh, get to uh, the website, get to Facebook, uh, you know, come to our Comic Book Corner page and, and post those three words and, 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 and win the book. So... Without further ado, here we have the art germ signing books. So we have this beauty uh, signed in pink up here with the beautiful art germ custom label. I love this custom label. I think it's one of the nicest custom labels available at CGC at the moment. Uh, another one. So I'm gonna probably keep one and sell the other one then we have this beauty as well it's the Catwoman foil sorry for the glare there we go Batman 135 nice signed in pink as well that's the one in 50 art germ variant Battle Chasers number 12 also an art germ variant very nice signed in white then we have, oh, this beauty, man. I'm holding on to this one. Send this one in for myself. It's the holiday special for issue 34. So keep that one for me. And we have the 30th anniversary special. That is the regular cover. And I believe I sent in a foil as well. Yes. So... The foil, I'm so happy, came back at 9.8, and it did have a little crease. I just want to see how did they miss that, man. Oh my god. Yeah. Well, I could still see it, but apparently CGC thinks it's still a 9.8. So, very happy for that, and I'm sure Jason is very happy too, considering that that's his book. All right. What else we got here? We have Catwoman number five, also Jason's. So this was already slabbed, cracked it. I think I pressed it. Yeah, there was a small non-color breaking crease. Another foil. And what else we got? Catwoman, I mean, sorry, Batman 134. And last but not least, oh, this bad boy. Wow. Man, that is a nice, nice Carnage cover, man. I didn't even know this existed until. Who was it? Somebody gave this to me to grade for them, send it in to submit. Man, I'm getting a block right now. Uh, George, I think. Yeah, man. Congrats, guys. Uh, everybody that submitted thank you for using comic book corner and uh 
Thank you for being patient with the unboxings. I know you guys have been waiting a while to see one, but again, I was not well, so <sighs> hopefully uh, we can figure things out and uh, figure out what's going on. But anyways, besides that, uh, thank you for joining. Thank you for uh, subscribing. And please, if you like the video, uh, thumbs up and like it and come back for more content. And good luck to the winner. Uh, I'm going to go check out Facebook right now and see if, uh, see if this whole uh, thing actually worked. All right.